Ladies and gentlebugs, welcome to another day of party antics at Valheim. Today we have Operation Got to Schmelt It All. Plenty of things to schmelt. I spent pretty much the whole day farming iron, um, organizing the basement a little bit more. So there has been some updates to the basement. We'll take some iron there. I have not smelted none of it. Oof. Okay, okay. Fine, I'll leave that there for now. I've not done anything um, pretty much other than harvesting iron backwards and forwards non-stop. Organized the basement a bit more. So I started doing some of this yesterday. We now got a list. There's going to be more chests going there and another row across the bottom. All of it's going to be labeled out into what is in each chest so we got iron black metal uh silver bronze copper tin we got linen there obsidian that's just leathers and pelts uh ancient bark we got core wood wood fine wood we got feathers i put quite a few out you know hours of work into that as well so farmed a lot of feathers we got a few chains, uh, wolf products, so fangs, pelts, trophies, whatnot. That chest is empty at the moment, so still to be allocated. I'm just making sure I got enough stuff on me to defend myself. We've been hit a few times today. And it's just non stop. Gotta keep the schmelters going. Once the schmelters are gone through, one, I can finally upgrade my armor um, to the next stage. Two, I can build the remainder boxes that are missing. There's a lot of iron in there as well from earlier. There's a load in the car. Um, so you can tell it's been... It's been busy. I've had some really, really good... Um, crypts today, so... I was fortunate enough... To get a nice little hole out of a few of them. So now we just got to pretty much melt the wall up. Once it's all smelted through, we can start allocating, you know, what goes where and so on. And pretty much just overall organize the whole thing properly. Farmed a lot of blood bags as well today. Um, run through the dark forest where I could to um, try and get as much trissel as possible. So we got that as well. Got quite a few chunks of that. It's been pretty much a long, long grind today. I woke up relatively early. Um, didn't really. Uh, leave the iron there. I'll just, might as well just top up those. I didn't really sleep that great last night, so woke up relatively early and in quite a spot of pain, unfortunately. So to keep my mind off things, I just went around and let's grind. Run 
fucking chest. So we now got tea smelt. So all the materials to smelt go in there. We got coal and we got wood for kilns. So that's quite full. I spent a few hours chopping down trees. Just pretty much harvesting. That I planted a few trees as well. Farmed quite a bit of, of uh, fine wood, farmed a metric ton of rock. Uh, plains are a really, really good place to uh, farm that um, that rock. Those big rock structures, they are dead easy to destroy. Mm, that's lined up there. Another one, another one, another one. There. Oof, missing foreign wood again. Oh man, I really do not want to have to go and farm more fine wood today. I don't want to chop another freaking tree for weeks to come. If I am to be completely honest. There's another one. Okay. Oh man, I'm gonna have to move them all. Yes, I am. I'm not gonna do it now. I'm just gonna settle them I'm in now. So we gone fully itemized inventory. There's gonna be a waste bin so I can take stuff off the server to despawn it and so on. So overall it's been a productive day. Oh, Kilms need more wood. My next step is going to be to uh, redo the um, Redo this building, so this building is going to get full overall completely redone kind of scenario. Cool. Iron. Cool. And there. Uh, so that's the next stage. It's pretty much going to be tear this entire building down, rebuild it. Um, originally, the building to the left, well, to my right here, 
this one was going to be a storeroom with a kitchen attached next to it I've changed my mind we're gonna have a fermenting room here for potions with a few more chests and we're gonna have the cooking station here and this is pretty and possibly just kind of park things um, certain things in there like carts and whatnot um, I'm not sure what's happening with the player that built that um, but that's most likely going to get an overall as well uh, especially because he built a lot of it with wood and whatnot so I'm going to be putting a lot of stone underneath it it's going to be built on a stone base we got to put the road down through here we got to say hello to that brute over there goodbye we do keep getting attacks from skeletons at the moment so I want to uh, I can hear them but I cannot see them my gates open no so they're not inside the house whoa lag hmm weird I can hear them cannot see them at all where the hell have they gone? And the next big step is going to be start working on the defense wall. Uh, we've cleared up a lot of the forest around here. I'm going to clear up possibly a couple of trees behind there. And start building the great wall. So that's most going to be the next big step to pretty much finish off the settlement here oh and obviously finish off the main house there's a few modifications I want to do to the main house on top of everything that I've already done today 12 iron we're on a full melt here Actually, I can take that 28 hour and then I don't think it's going to be enough to upgrade my um, armor yet. I can't remember how much I need for it. So, top side guys, everything's still the same. Um, same old, not much change. Downstairs. I went down by one level so I scattered out a few lights we got the portal sorted now so we got the silver portal still there we got the spawn to base which is the primary portal for anyone coming into the server that's new we got exploring tree which is set up there we got exploring two which is set up there as well then we have Yes, I did go and have some fun with Mother as well. Um, so, we have Mother. And we got Bone Mass, as you guys remember. Some of you. Yo! What up, Joe? How you doing, dude? And I put Bone Mass's head there. So, we now got the trophy heads of the bosses above the... Uh, mother's horns going through the roof through the floor oh shit uh, okay that was unexpected um, I may have to uh, reconsider how that one is being put down I might have to move him down a bit more uh, <laughs> so that kind of failed so we've got 
Uh, there's going to be an itemized arrow, so needle arrows, uh, poison arrows, fire arrows, and whatnot. And obviously, you know, we've got all this shit here. Haha, <laughs> it's all good, dude. So I've kind of modified it a bit, man. I took it down by one tier. So I've added a new level. This, I don't know if you were on the stream the last time when I added this doors. So I've added some doors out through the side here. So we've got easy access rather than keep having to go up and down. And now pretty much to walk down, you just walk into a fully functional workshop, forge area, everything. So as you can see, I've putting a fully itemized storage unit. And also sorted out the portals on this side. It just makes life easier. You like the little unrails? Dude, I just thought I'd put something in the middle there because otherwise it's just a big empty void space. It was a bit of a... Yeah, I need something. You know, it's... Otherwise you just got nothing but a void in there. All reinforced chests, yeah. It's been a lot of freaking time farming iron and going through crypts and everything. So, yeah. Uh, farmed quite a lot of trees as well. Uh, farmed quite a bit of fine wood. Um, farmed a nice chunk of stone too even though in trying to fight on goblins and pulling a cart at the same time is a little bit difficult but there you go you know those big massive stone pillars in the plains If you break the base of them, the wall thing crumbles and they give you a metric ton of stone. So that's pretty much what I was uh, hitting today. But yeah, that stone bench will eventually move and go somewhere where I don't know yet. I'm most likely going to add a couple of chests in that hole as well. You know, got to make the most of the space we've got. You know. So, but yeah. All reinforced chests. Uh, you know, we've got the trophies there. Um, some, of, A lot of these are still empty. Some just have mixed up junk. I'm going to possibly, what I'm going to put in this corner is going to be uh, the waste. And I might... But a couple of chests here as a overflow from uh, when we are, you know, just quickly raiding somewhere and we just need to come in, dump the crap and come back. The next big step is going to be... After blowing up another bird, I really need to start carrying wood arrows. That was a bit of a waste of a frost arrow. Next big step is going to be to build the... Um, thingy. The Great Wall. Hey. 
But is it as smart as where I hit a workbench? That's gonna be the golden question, dude. Is it as smart as where I hit my a workbench? Now, you see there's nothing there. Look where she is. <laughs> and <laughs> so now, you can also repair stuff right outside of the gate. Come on. <laughs> so right under the staircase. I still need to finish off the main building. So there's going to be some more work coming on that as well. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Houston, we have a problem. That workbench is sticking up the stairs. I need, I'm going to have to sort that out when it's not raining. Do I got wood on me? I do. Okay, two of them will do. That's enough to dry me off. Keep me dry. Um, iron goes in there. Feathers. Whoa, hello. Welcome to the log. Uh, I farmed a few cores as well. So it's been... Overall, dude, it's been a long ass day. I mean, let's face it, it doesn't exactly look great, does it? Uh, crafting bench. Easily does it. Grab the pickaxe. One more. Come on. See? Doesn't that look much nicer? Still none the wiser. <laughs> That's some 200 IQ stuff. Well, hiding the bench inside the, um, inside the staircase. I'm going to be hiding a bench inside the wall when I build the wall. Uh, there. Dude, I've got so much shit all over the place. I don't even know which side to look at that moment. I don't even know what I'm grabbing or what I'm not grabbing. Well, I might be hiding a chest of stuff that is undead secret stash. <laughs> we don't know yet. We'll have to wait and see.
it's metric tons. I need to go into camp prison as well to um, harvest the uh, stuff from there. Well, I am having a lot of issues with one of the up one of the upgrades for the bench, dude. It's the only one I cannot put down. It's this one. I cannot put it down in there for no level money. It just shows red everywhere I try to put this thing down. Got enough iron to take in. We can take that black ma dark metal as well. Black metal, iron. See, isn't this much easier? People are not going to have any excuse. Yeah, that's the thing. I can place it in front of the table. That's it. That's the only place I can put it, is in front of the forge. So I can place it there. I can't do it anywhere else. There is one thing I haven't tried yet. But that would involve moving the... Um, I've even broke the wall behind it and try and put it behind it. Nope. Nothing. So we got our little uh, workbench fully done up and we've got the forge all done up as well. Little uh, till rock in the wall, everything. I quite like uh, the way it's gone, to be honest. Eat the carrot soup, get a little bit more health. Feels like we're coming up to night time. I need to put some oil on that. Yeah, but by that norm, shouldn't I be able to... Oh, hello. Shouldn't I be able to place it? Aha! Uh -huh. Oh! I can place it there. Deer hide chains is all I need. Uh, deer hide. Nope. Wrong chest. There. Deer hide chains. Uh, what did I destroy? Was it the anvils? Yes, it was. Wood. Now I cannot place the anvils there, or there, or there. I can place it in fucking front of it, again. Man, this shit is tough. I could place it there. Why does this game always have to mess with my freaking feng shui?
See, that's still in range. He won't do it. Might have to place it there. I'll just place it there. Doesn't look too out of place there. Yeah, I saw about that, but I don't like it. <laughs> it doesn't look too shabby there. Looks alright. But I need to sort out walls, dude. I keep getting hit by skeletons as well at the moment and all that shit. So I just kind of want to sort out walls for the wall place. Come on, stop making a pain in the ass. That <laughs> looks like a mob bucket. <laughs> Point taken. You know, it's, um, so that's going to be one of the next big steps in the settlement is going to be the Great Wall. So, I'm not kind of looking forward to that. I know that's going to be a bitch and a half to do. Um, so, yeah. Especially when, you know, a lot of the stuff people that come into the server are kind of limited on time so it does hinder you a bit there's a lot of resources to farm there's a lot of shit you know to go and get as you well know it does take time All that shit at the end of the day, dude, you know, it's just countless amounts of hours farming. You and I both know wood does not go far in this game. And stone. Another stack. Let me go on Arvest uh, Camp Prison. Uh, camp Prison is going to be through this one. See, this portal has a double function. This is what I call saving. See? <sighs> Fuck this.
It's kind of when I don't want to set up a outpost in the swamp. And on this seed, bone masses spawn is literally right next door to this. So, you know, why not? Would be a fool not to take advantage of uh, what's right there. I hate planting these things at night. Okay, we're gonna move to four only then. I keep getting browns. As seeds go, dude, this is possibly one of the uh, best um, seeds I've seen. I might eventually expand this farm as well. We'll have to wait and see on that one. Ah, oh, shit. There goes the Coast Guard Elo. Sounds like somebody's in trouble. I'm in a direct flight path of the Coast Guard Elos. So uh, whenever they get deployed, I just hear them flying outside. <laughs> that normally means some motherfucker is in trouble.
You're having problems with Discord? What, did you hop on comms? I didn't even hear you if you did, man. I don't normally sit on open comms when I'm streaming, I do sometimes do it. Whoa! Damn! You Discord duping, man. Isn't one Discord account enough for you, man? <laughs> right, another bunch of iron. Another bunch of coal. Yeah, Discord sometimes can be a pain in the ass, man. Um, oh, hello. Uh, how much over am I? 60 kilos? Okay. Ah, shit. I still got all the chains on me, don't I? Bollocks. Another 20 wet flower. <laughs> you have no idea how to use it. <laughs> you get used to it, dude. Ah, I got no space. Shit. Uh, let's swap that with that, shall we? Um. That goes there. Rest can go in the house for now. Yeah, I got the habit of closing the doors behind me all the time. I know sometimes it's annoying as fuck, but when you literally got jumped on by 12 skeletons in the basement of your own gaff trust me guys you very quickly learn that lesson and I mean very quickly upgrade so I need 20 iron let's grab a full stack why not I mean we got enough Boom. Armor rating has gone up. Is that the trousers? No. Armor rating at 70. And put that in. I might make the padded helmet. Even though I do like the Drake helmet. But the padded helmet offers 26 armor. Which is the same as the Drake. Uh, 
Um, even if I don't like it, somebody else in the server can have it. Padded cur, uh, padded helmet. You do need to set up, um, obviously, your microphone and all that stuff as well. Thirty-two, jeez. So there's an improvement there. Yeah, you come at me, boys. You come at me now. Oh, loads of linen. Uh, we'll dump it into that box. We'll put the drake in there. Uh, there's an overflow of stone in one of these. There is regular wood into this one. And that one has got war eyes. Did I put ancient seeds down as a trophy? No, I didn't. We'll put some ancient seeds down there and some moves down there for now. Man, this cord is a must needed thing. If you're a gamer, this cord is like. Godson. Oh, there it goes again. Pum 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 pum. Oh, one thing, dude. I am literally burning this iron fast. And the wood. Do you have it um, just on your phone, or do you have it on your computer as well? And... Uh, I can go up... Yeah, that's possibly why it's messing up, dude. You might need to um, open it on the um, computer itself. Download the um, Discord into your rig. Discord over in the uh, internet web page is a little bit buggy as fuck, is the best way to put it down. As Got to say, I'm liking this new space, man. It's light. It's got enough light on it to uh, see everything. I couldn't dig any deeper. Well, I could. I could go down one more. Uh, but any more than one, and then that's it. I mean, the... Um, I'm literally in the water. Why, your computer can't handle it, Joe? Or... See, I'm running it on my phone as well. Um, and I also run it, obviously, on my computer. 
So the first thing normally I tend to do in the mornings... Let's see if we can snatch this up a bit. Uh, core wood. First thing I normally tend to do in the morning when I wake up is check Discord. Check Twitch. Then check Facebook. <laughs> oh. Oh, I like it. I mean, apart from the gate going through it, I kind of like it. But the fact the gate goes through it pisses me off. So it's going back. We're uh, we're changing the plans here. Oh shit, yeah, I remember that now. I remember that. I completely forgot. Well, Valheim in here, dude. I'm lucky to get 27. As soon as I walk out of that house, man, and I start running down, he starts going up. By the time I get near the waterfront, I'm on about close to 50. <laughs> if I'm lucky. So, yeah. Ooh. You need a RAM upgrade, man. Four gig of RAM nowadays don't really get you far. It's like, for example, the new Ryzen's. A lot of people are going Ryzen's with um, 16 gigs of RAM, and they just don't cut it. PC upgrade? Oh, Jesus Christ, our windmill is nearly stopped now. <laughs> For now you have YouTube. <laughs> well, with point, that is a win-win scenario, man. When you decide to upgrade, man, I definitely recommend Ryzen's. As it stands, I mean, they are miles ahead. AMD is miles ahead of um, Intel. Fucking trolls. Oh, this wasn't trolls. This was those... Fucking fireball guys. Oh, okay, that one's not repairing. It'll probably show us repaired in about 10 minutes. I got hit with a metric ton of fireballs earlier. Okay, structurally, everything seems to uh, 
be panning up. That one isn't. Okay, I need to come up with some core wood. There's two two cross beams missing there. Oof, that one was nearly done for. What the hell? Jesus, those motherfuckers wreck a building. All I saw was the message, the uh, stench of sulfur. And that was it. Uh, all hell broke loose. I still need to figure out how am I gonna light up the top of that lighthouse. Um, that is definitely gonna be uh, bugging me for a while. More wood for the kilns. There, we need more iron. Oh, and grab a stack of coal. Might as well refill the kilns while I'm at it. I went through so much hassle, dude, and I was gonna put a bonfire up top, he won't let me put the bonfire up. It sucks. You have any idea how hard it was to get this circle done? Even though it doesn't look perfect. And even knowing there is a couple of holes on the outside still. Like there's one in there I need to fill. So all the hassle to put this up dude. And then it just didn't work. So I still don't know what to put up here. To um, pretty much give as much light as possible. I'm gonna have to play around and figure out what I'm gonna put up there. So that definitely sucked, man. I was, I wanted to put the, um, thingy up there that was literally my goal I was gonna go for the um, a big bonfire up top of it and then he just went invalid placement I'm like fuck you <laughs> I was not an happy bunny I can tell you that let's go and check on all flux No wheat. 
clock should be flowering by now. No, it's not. Yeah, there's a couple. Shit, I lost quite a few on that row. Bummer. Well, what a flower out of that, apart from that one, which is telling me not enough space. But there's gonna be quite a bit of flower on that one. Some run, some iron, some metal, a couple of bones, that's it. Mind up having to do another cart just to put stuff on. We'll have, uh, I'll have to wait and see. That's all the coal I just brought out. Yep, no more coal. That one. Reload. This is literally operation got to smelt it all, man. The kilns and smelters and everything, I kind of want to keep them as close to the dock as possible. Because that's going to be pretty much the main point where you arrive with the boats to unload. So that I definitely want to keep as close to the dock as possible. The farming ground here, I might actually expand that outwards. I might bring it down by a couple more rows. Um, fucking hell, loads of crap on the floor here. It's kind of shit that causes server issues. Flint. So that I kind of want to bring out a bit more. I'm going to have to figure out a way to protect those beehives as well. Because even behind the wall, they're still getting hit. Mm -mm. I hear something. Do you just get obliterated? Oof. Sucks to be you, boy. Thing is, when it comes to refilling all these lanterns, dude, I'm going to be using a metric ton of resin. <laughs> this shit's just going to be resin town. I kind of want a few more people to join in as well, so, you know, we can go do things like serpent hunting and all that shit. For now, I'll put a hold on the boar breeding as well. I'm going to want to move them. You think you fixed? What well, on uh, on Discord?
more coal. <laughs> ah, so that's why you were showing S2 accounts. Yeah, I only bother with one Discord account, dude. One on that is bad enough. I don't think the world is ready for two of me. Um. Oh, good lord. That thing couldn't move any more, any slower even if you wanted. I just leave it running, dude. He'll get done.
Well, oh, Schmalt is a stop. Not about your firing. Man, this is gonna take ages to go through. I'm also not sure whether to just destroy my wolf camp, Joe, or once I build the palisades, walk my wolves back to base and just leave them loose on the base. Because that might work nicely. <laughs> you spooking people? Damn. I'm also tempted to do something else. They just follow you. You can get them on the boats and shit. I'm not sure how easy you can get them off the boats. Trophies are a bitch, because the main issue you're going to get with trophies, dude, is the fact that the trophies just do not, um, as soon as they break eyesight with you, they just despawn. I'm actually tempted to do a double wall here. You would, go, you would be big. I mean, water on this side is not that far away from me. We got a nice little bay here. I'll possibly dig out that. Break the trees, dig out that, all that. Or just put a bridge from there across and put the dock on there. Build a wall there and build a wall there and have a boat have a long boat on this side and have a long boat on that side so this side i could use the long boat deployed there and there saving me from going all the way around either way oh no i'll build a bridge with stone dude <laughs> But if you can see, that's where the main house is. And that's literally the island I was just looking at. So as you can see, it's not that far away. The, the main house is, well, it's obviously closer to this bay, but it's kind of in the middle. So if I stand in the center of the house, which is here, you see it's pretty much in the halfway between both sides. I may even just enclose it into that bay there. So a little bay there, I might actually just enclose it into it. That's gonna be a lot of fucking stone, dude. I 
The advantage with having the wolves around the base is that the wolves will protect your base. The downside is if you get hit by big mobs, you screwed. Trolls will literally destroy um, the wolves. So, yeah. But, if you go enough wolves, they will just literally destroy everything and anything. Because, that's what wolves do. Because there comes the thing, if you bring the wolves up, and if you just toss meat on the floor, the wolves will actually breed um, randomly. You just got to make sure that, uh, you know, you keep your piggies uh, locked up. Otherwise, it can go south very, very fast. Another bunch of coal. <sighs> Man. I'm still smelting shite. Let's take a chunk back now. Gives me something to do. Oh, why not? <laughs> That's why I sent you those uh, screenshots earlier, dude. Because I know you haven't seen it yet when I send them to you. That's why I sent them to you earlier. Just to uh, to show you what good old Undead has been up to. One, two, three, four, five, six. Tell you what, man. My Viking's meaty. He can carry two tons of weight in his back. And he doesn't break his legs. <laughs> nah, you're not the... Stack of that. Jesus. These kilns burn through shit. Hey, I just beat you on FPS, dude. I just tanked down to a grand total of six. As I turn around.
You being generous. <laughs> oh, and this is gonna take a while to do. Yeah, I might decide to do that. Have one boat on each side. And just uh, run it through. I do want to go and explore all that as well. Open up the main island completely. Or instead of just putting a wall all the way through, I might just put a little wall there with a um, just a boat dock and put a road in between up to the main house. So I need to start um, clearing up portals and shit. Well, clearing up areas of the map now. Hold on a sec. And I'm back. Dude. Mining these kilns is almost a full time job. Jesus. Alright. And uh... Uh, we got enough coal, add wood for the kiln. Refill that one. Come on, refill the schmelt. Refill that one. told you the best one Joe I had somebody that wanted to um, wanted in on the server right and as soon as I said I went well 
any of your old gear, drop it into a box and I'll take it out of the uh, server and despawn it. Oh, you can do that in the server, you know, and you can uh, also spawn in items and everything. And I say, yeah, you can spawn items on my server, dude. You got to go old school grind on it. Oh, uh, all right. Uh, okay. I'm still waiting for that person to come in. Uh, yeah. Oh no, dude, he's just... He's just, he just would um, literally just spawn items and shit like that. It's almost like... Well, what's the point... What's the point in playing the game then? If you're not gonna be willing to grind the stuff... What is the point in, you know, doing anything whatsoever in the game if you're not willing to uh, grind it up is there even any point in it because I don't see it that's you know the other part of Alheim I mean if you're not going to be grinding shit what's the point because granted they have mentioned DLCs and shit well, they haven't mentioned the LCs. I've seen words on the wire about the LCs. So, there is going to be, hopefully, some new sh stuff coming out soon. Yeah, exactly. I just leave it like this, dude. It'll eventually get done. Oh, thank you. Ah, hot, 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 hot! Ah! Hot coffee. Hot coffee. You know, all the area where this w is, dude, um, I'll s spawn the seed into a map and I'll take a screenshot of it and send it to you. All the area where um, I've got this in, literally you... Where am I going? i got nothing for you. <laughs> All the area where this is used to be a forest. There was even... Where that uh, boathouse is, it was actually rock. We uh, smashed all the rock down. There was three of us just constantly breaking um, stone down. Well, cutting trees down. Oh, we done it in no time, dude. With three of us, it literally took fuck all time to do.
coal, iron, wood. See, isn't this much quicker now? No more messy chests. Three chests is all we need. And then you also got the cart. So. Uh oh. Looks like we got you. Looks like we got ourselves some skellies. Something just got hit hard. Motherfucking moved. Oh yeah, we got skills. Another reason why I want to put the wall up. I believe it's a small one, dude. What do I need for a personal chest? For real? For real? Fuck you, you're gonna kill me. Uh, just... We'll find out. I'll go, and, I'll go and craft one in the house. I got the iron. I'll craft one up and then I'll just destroy it. I think it's actually a really small one. Uh, fine, what is there? Six items. So it's pretty much the uh, smallest of the lot. No, it's on that one. I don't even know why I put the coal away. Here comes another storm. Wow, you were saying I needed a storm, dude? Well, there you go. I'll get that fucking windmill going.
Oh, she's full. I just went back there to double check. She's full. Well done, boy. Shadow, just go and lie down. I mean, you trying to uh, convince me, dog, that you went and lie down? My dog likes to come in and put it, ends up putting his head on my keyboard all the goddamn time. Tío, ¿cómo estás? ¿Qué pasa? ¿Está todo bien contigo? ¿Vueltaste la pesca de nuevo? M, todos los días yo lo pienso. Hoy voy a volver a la pesca y todos los días yo cambio mi... Mi pensamiento. <risa> oh, but Jesus Christ, that thing's going. Oh, but damn. I think this thing might actually break at this right. Jesus Christ. Sí, M. Todo bien. Lo... M, tú no... Lo fas un tiempo que tú no viste mi casa nueva. <laughs> hey, I'm not bilingual. I'm trilingual because I'm posh. Esa es la cocina, M, para hacer todas las comidas. Aquí está la casa. Tengo una, dos puertas nuevas por aquí. Mira el almacén. Para guardar todo. You see? Oh, y M. Aquí tienes mi trono. 
Joe, I'm originally Portuguese. I spent two years in Spain and I've been in the UK for 16. So I speak three languages. Y la mejor de todo, M. Mi cama buena. <laughs> sí, eso es verdad, ¿no? Ay, tienes allí mi lo barco también. Twelve left on me. Now, um, Joe, Emma is um, one of my long-term subs from Twitch. One of my longest subs on Twitch, and um, I normally play Russian fishing a lot. I haven't played it for a while. That's my Twitch gig is uh, RF4 pretty much. And um, I haven't spoken with him for a while, so he just uh, he came in to say hello. I think it's on, he's on a nine months. He's a nine months up now. So. Damn. Come on, keep cranking. Keep cranking. Another six. Another bunch of flour. Jesus, these storms. I got so much shit. This is the next one to be organized. Kitchen area. Oh yeah. Emma has uh, spent a lot of hours watching me on Twitch. Emma, yo todas las mañanas, Emma, yo estoy mirando panda y todas las mañanas yo veo panda y está pegando nada, nada de nada. Garantido que panda está casi a nivel 43 y entonces la pesca para él va a estar muy más lenta. Mas yo tengo estado mirando él y él no no está sacando nada. Está muy muy paradito. No sé si está Alguna cosa activa en condiciones o no? Ah, 
body is about to slow down. You can just hear it slowing down. these this one resin goes up there uh, I think it's that one yep that one still has space for a little bit more stone iron goes there And I best go and check on uh, my form. It's non stop, man. See, that's the thing. If there was more people. Oh, there you go. They flowered up. Oh, some of it's ready to pick up. I do like the uh, flowers on the flax. They do look pretty damn cool. You're going the wrong direction, you dumb nut.
for us to preserve Kahara. Well, that's the thing. They're going on the complete opposite direction from where I need them to go. Oh, man. Come on. Stop moving there. There we go. I haven't tried them yet, no. Bastard. Mind up having to do more fucking arrows in a minute. Oh man, what the hell? Fuck off. Come on. There goes one! Come on. Too low. Motherfucker just walked straight past it. There goes two. Needle arrows will um, also do a lot of damage. Thing is, I found out kind of accidentally that a lot of things in this game that are not in the ice uh, biomes or mountain biomes have a bit of an alert allergy to uh, cold attacks. So that's kind of why I just tend to use a lot of ice arrows plus it staggers them he's done one more Oh, I picked up a Lox trophy. That's why that motherfucker was so stubborn to kill. Only 12 meat?
I hear a goblin. Oh, he just took an arrow to the fucking face. By the power invested in me by Tor, I banish you. Yeah. Oh, I use a lot of needle arrows as well, dude. It's my two most used arrows are pretty much either needle or... Um... Oh, shit. That was a load of grain there to pick up. Bollocks. Kind of jumped the gun on this one. I either tend to use a lot of uh, needle arrows or I tend to use... Um, ice for the planes dude I found ice works much much better for me because it's just every time you hit anything in the planes with one it staggers them and obviously you got poison damage from the bow uh, blobs are extremely weak against ice attacks as well Well, didn't you see that, um, that blob that was right next to me? I put an arrow into it and it just instantly disintegrated. Okay, okay. We got plenty of flux on this run, dude. Damn. Uh, we'll put 40 there. We got some more wheat to still process well barley um, I'll wait until I pick up everything and then I'll leave some behind drugs are also weak against um, ice Silver arrows will do some damage to them, but ice, dude, yeah, they don't like ice. That's what I mean. Anything out of the mountain biome, they just do not like anything cold. It just seems to be the one thing they just don't seem to like at all. Okay, so it gives me two per piece. I still got what, four there, so that's eight. Uh, we'll leave 40 behind. I'll leave 50 behind. Fuck it. Uh, nope. Runky. 50 behind. Flax, we can do it just 44, that's fine. I'm not gonna do the same mistake of planting it at night. I'm tempted to go all the way south on the map. I'm tempted to just 
get the boat and go south. We've been going north. I'm tempted to go south. And I might do that once I've got all of that um, iron um, smelted. Where's that guy? No, no, no. E barley, you can just plant it straight out. You don't need to uh, see that. So carrot, you've got to pick up and plant for seed. Barley, you can just replant it straight out. And the same thing with flax. For real? Get fucked. And you pick up barley and flax initially, you collect it out of the um, goblin camps in the plains. Alright, first things first. Fuck's sake, something is breaking something. This is why I need to do that wall. I'm not doing the wall today. I'm not in the mood for a wall building. I can just hear something fighting in the background. There they are. Oh look, skellies again. Hello mate. Play ball. Another one somewhere around here. Hmm. Suspicious. Yeah, I got my headphones set up on uh, directional audio. Well, my headphone, um, my headphones are actually set up for FPS shooters at the moment. I just keep it like that by default. So if I decide to jump into something like Warzone or I think they're by the pigs again. That's what Skelly's like to attack. Oh, look, there's a brute. And about come on. Oh, he just got fucked up. They like to come and skellies like to come and attack my boars for some reason. Uh, no, I haven't, but I have been told that workbenches stop uh, monster spawn, apparently. Uh, 
Uh, I need more. Oh, it's been proven false? Oh, that's interesting. So, I'm guessing my best option to protect my camp is bring the wolves down and let them build the wall around the place, bring the wolves down and just let them procreate. I'm guessing that's my best option. If that's been proven false, then I'm not seeing many other options there. Well, I've got no grass back there, dude, and they're still spawning. The same thing there. I'm finding necks randomly just... Okay, there we go. Skellies. Silver damage is lethal on these guys. It's absolutely bonkers. Well, I'm not sh sure how accurate that is as well, dude, because I've been finding a load of necks just in the middle of this. And there's no grass, there's nothing on it. I think I'm just going to bring my wolves down and just let them run. Yeah, but that's the thing. I never used to have necks in there either. No, it's all good, dude. Right. Uh, pelts. No, wrong chest. Full of the obsidian. Uh, duck and go there. Uh, trophies. Top shelf. No, come on. Open the chest. Yep, there it is. Duck and go there for now. Pum, pum, pum. I need to go into the kitchen area, but I kind of want to empty this one first. One, two, three, four. That's enough for it. And one, two, three, four. There we go. Oh, wrong way. That can go there. Coins go on that one. Yeah, you can tell I've been uh, kind of busy-ish today. Let's go and cook all that lox meat. I don't want to cook lox tails. Oh well. Fuck it. Too late. Uh, the... I'm guessing you're talking about the wards?
pum pum pum. I think it's on this one. Locksmith, flower. Um, I need to go hunt for more berries as well. Starting to uh, run a little bit low on those. Soul systems go, dude. Do you think I got enough uh, food to, for a couple of campaigns? Serpent stews. Trying to keep this shit organized is proving a bitch. I'll do. We got quite a few serpent stews, courtesy of uh, the local uh, serpent hunting expeditions. No, uh, berries keep respawning, dude. Berries just keep um, respawning, you just need to keep going back uh, to pick them up. So it is. It's the only thing that just kinda takes up time. Um, those berries, they only spawn on the uh, plains. Blood bags, raspberries, dandelion, honey. Okay, honey, hold on. We're gonna cheat here. Have it. Costas de mi fabrica de miel. Uh, raspberries, blood bugs, raspberries, dandelions. Ah, oh, shit. Um, yeah, I've got, I went literally just leech hunting today. That was not fun, I can assure you that. Um,. Leech hunting was possibly a very... Do you think I got enough needles as well, dude? Fucking mosquitoes everywhere. Leech hunting was a very, very painful experience. Oh, hold on. I can do another pie. Okay, okay. We'll do another pie then. Let's grab another stack of flour. <laughs> Dude, I literally just went hunting for those today. It's all I... 
So, whenever I went back to the swamp for Iron Dude, I just pretty much went after leeches. Over and over and over and over again. Which obviously comes with a metric ton of drugs and all the nasty shit that comes attached to leech hunting. Well, a couple of days ago, dude, um, I think you were actually on the stream when that happened. We hit three serpents in, three uh, sea serpents in one run. That was a pretty damn good um, expedition, to be honest. That's the kind of expedition I like. Profitable on the um, good food side. Oh, fuck off, game. Okay. Yeah, we got one on the way up. And two on the way down. Yeah, we um, we literally on the way on the way up um, towards the uh, prison camp on the boat. We hit one, and on the way down we got two of them. We were tow trucking one into shore, and the other one decided, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna have a piece of your boat as well." So I was like, alright then. And as we dragged one to shore and killed it, the other one actually stayed by the shoreline. So I just hooked it and dragged it um, ashore as well. So we ended up... We got a collection of um, serpent scales. It's in one of the chests in the main house somewhere. Uh, I think it's in this one. No, that one. No, that one. They got 46 uh, serpent scales. Yeah, the first one, I believe we dragged it into the planes. So literally I just told them to stay on the fucking boat before they got wrecked on it. Because <laughs> we all know what would have happened to them as soon as they got in those planes, dude.
While I wait for these, I'm gonna go and uh, do a batch of uh, needle arrows. Obsidian arrows. Well, ah, fuck it, leave them there for now. It's hitting the bench, dude. I need to literally, I'm taking that building down and I'm gonna redesign it. And we'll take a few feathers. What else do they take? I know they'll take regular wood. Oh no. Oh, you just need of arrows and feathers. All right then. When you put enough hours into the fucking grind, you end up being able to do shit like this. Ah, uh, needle arrows. I think I got a couple. Ah, uh, dude, I don't care. It takes a lot to piss me off. But trust me, people know when they pissed me off. I'm a blunt, I'm a blunt asshole, dude. I just say it as it is. <laughs> The most common phrase on Twitch is, who the fuck do you think you are? Get the fuck out of my stream. That's my most common phrase on Twitch, dude. <laughs> yeah, people, a lot of people, like, I'm not the kind of streamer that, you know, oh, it's all good, and then goes behind your back and just goes, oh, dude. I had this guy on my channel yesterday, money was doing my fucking head in. You know, and I just had to bite my tongue about it. I don't. I just say it as it is, man. Always have, always will. Uh, needle arrows. Okay, so that's wood arrows, that's for hunting. Everything, everything, comp you know, all in different compartments, man, is such a fucking breeze. Way, way easier than what was happening before. Once everything gets properly organized, man, it's just going to make my life so much easier. And everybody else's.
You're pretty much just gonna be run down there, whatever you need is gonna be, you know, in a box with a label. Fuck me, that chest was full of wood, dude. Jesus Christ. Look, it's picking up speed. Like a little turbo. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Fucking hell, man. Yeah, but... Dude, it's too much for me. When you're on your own, it's too much shit. <laughs> I spend my time running backwards and fucking forwards, man. By now, my running should be at the hundred. I mean, it's all I'm doing at the moment is just run backwards, forwards, backwards, forwards. Refill the kilns, refill the smelters, refill the kilns, refill the smelters. You know, it's non fucking stop. Possibly be exploring right now. I want to go as far south as I can. We've gone north. Um, I suppose I could go and set up a camp for um, Yaglov. I could go and set up an FOB for it, but I can't be fucked. It's always me that goes in and sets up the four bases. I don't know, I've never been there. I know it's cold up north.
Oh, spicy. So I'm guessing taking uh, fire resist potions might not be a bad move then. Just, uh, just kind of thinking here. I mean, my gear is fully maxed out. I do have the frostner, so if it's fire down there, the frostner should do some good effects on it. I'll deploy with the portal kit on the boat and so I can just port in. I do have a spare portal at the moment, I believe. Time to go and check on it. Oh boy. Yeah, I got hit by fire guys earlier, dude. It was not fun. Uh, do I have a spare portal? That's connected, connected, connected. Uh, no, doesn't look like it. I'll just set up a spare portal. So, that row needs another two boxes. All of those have to be moved. Um, well, something has to be moved. Even the ones on the right have to be moved, or the ones on the left have to be moved. It's one of the two. Um, I'm probably going to move the ones on the right. It seems to be a bit less... If I deploy a spare portal, I can always just fast travel back, uh, take 10 wood on me for to deploy an emergency um, repair station and whatnot. Possibly take a full stack so I can build an outpost there if I need to. <laughs> oh yeah, dude, I've I mastered the drill of uh you know taking the long boat out and surviving it. <laughs> Take some potions with me as well. Uh once I've got the portal set up I should be fine. But take a couple of potions with me. Possibly take the harpoon. If I bump into a snake, I'll try and take it out. If I've got, you know, any land visible that I can uh, drag it into and annihilate it, then I'll do that. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, dude. I mean... A lot of the thing in this game is preparing. You've got to be prepared when you go out. That's why I always take 10 wood in the boat as an emergency and shit like that. If you prepare for the journeys of for and for where you're going, there's a big likelihood you're going to survive it. There's no two ways about it. 
if you don't prepare, then you fucked. You just literally get ripped apart and kiss goodbye to it. I do want to go and check if I still got a boat somewhere. I should still have a carve somewhere there if it's not been destroyed. Uh, long story short, I ended up dying there, having to go back out with the other boat, and one of the boats ended up staying there. If the boat is still there, then I'm going to deploy a little um, portal. I'm going to bring the boat back, port back in, destroy the portal, and... Um, Take the long boat out. Because I ain't going on a long journey on the car. Fuck that shit. I'm former military, dude. If I ever went on, if I ever went on the field unprepared, that was the difference between me coming back home in one piece or coming back home in uh, multiple pieces. Suppose I could do that. We nearly done through all the iron, dude. Recon. So, you know. When it comes when it comes uh emergency deployment time, yeah. Go out unprepared, then you are literally screwed. Portugal. Fuck off. And so two stacks of wood. Run, boy, run. That's the rest of my flax. There's the rest of my uh, other stuff. So, we, uh, when it came to, you got to uh, suit up, boot up, and get going. Yeah, I thought so. I did think you didn't want a piece of this, but I just wasn't too sure. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Linen. 
Oh! Oh, oh, oh! That was so damn fucking close. There we go. We got ch nearly a full chest of iron now. That's fucking awesome. Oh, trust me, it's not. It's, it wasn't easy over there either. I'm gonna show you that. You don't. Uh, you don't gain your uh, graduation by uh, slacking around. You gain it by blood, sweat, and tears. And pretty much kind of in that order as well. It's a constant grind non-stop. Pretty much. Most common thing is sleep deprivation. Your sleep deprivation is stupidly high. You know, you constantly... They... Yeah. They don't like you to sleep, pretty much. Especially if you get selected, you know, or kind of pre-selected to go into the QRF, then sleep deprivation is the norm. It's pretty much something that just comes in every single day. Would I go back in? No. If I was to go back in time, would I still do it again? Yes. It's as simple as that. You know, there's no... He done me some good. He done me some bad. I mean, depends on whichever way you see it. Have I done shit I'm proud of? Yes. Have I done shit I absolutely, you know, wish I never done? Oh, hell yeah. yeah. I mean... There's a multitude of things that uh, happens when you go into something like that. Uh, no. On with the YouTube chat, dude. Other than that, there's Steam, which I did message somebody on uh, Steam. And obviously Discord, which I do sometimes message people in the background. Uh, actually, I haven't checked my Twitch inbox today. 
Oh, my Twitch inbox is quiet. What is going on? <laughs> nah. Jump, jump, oh shit! I run out of stamina for the jump, jump. Another eleven iron. Oh, dude, we are so fucking close to being done. Jesus. Damn, man. 16 is all I got left. The takedown. No. I do not want to play that. You'd make the fish tacos? <laughs> Why can't you? You didn't haven't spent enough hours fishing or... Hey, fish tacos are good tacos, boy. I come from a fishing town back in Portugal, man. I love fish. <laughs> the taco! I'm also a former chef. <laughs> so yeah, don't start, don't get me started on food, boy. That's a road you will regret. I can tell you straight away. You might struggle a bit. Even with my PC sometimes I struggle because it seems that if you are having really bad lag or FPS or a shit ping, it uh, leeches into mine. As it stands at the moment, I'm getting 30 FPS where I am, with everything that's happening around me. Jesus, that's a full chest of fucking wood. Damn it, I'm gonna need to go farming for more wood tomorrow. Every day, boy. It's like cut trees. Cut trees. Do you want to laugh? <laughs> I 
So that's 48 fish there. Hold on, there's got to be more somewhere. Or maybe not. Maybe that's all I got. 48 fish. I don't think fishing will be um, too bad, dude. I noticed one thing as well. If... Um, If there's multiple players on a boat and um, they start walking across the deck, it seriously lags you out. And I mean seriously. It's pretty damn horrible. I mean, I, sh I got enough, more than enough coin to buy bait. And there's a nice little fishing spot just off the lighthouse there. See, this was built by somebody that came on the server. Watch this. Watch the bed, because it's hilarious. Just wait for the waves. All we had to do was go up a little bit more. No. Had to leave it this low. Gotta wait on um, the rest of the iron to smelt, really. Can I sleep? I don't think I can sleep, I think it's still middle of the day. Oh yes, I can. Snooze time! Day 504, Jesus Christ. For real. By the power of Tor, I banish you. Empty smelter, empty smelter. That's just cool. I think one of the guys is actually. He did mention earlier to me that he might join. But I'm not sure what time he's going to finish work. Ooh, so you still got a while before you upgrade it. Uh... 
Uh, why did I come all the way here without bringing the cart out? Right. This cart is literally filled up with stone. I was gonna store it in the main building, but if I'm gonna build a wall, I might as well just kinda store it in here. Yes, I know. Oh, you, my 500 days in game. That one's gonna go into the storage as well. Right, so fire resist potions, eld and stamina, one stock of each. Serpent stews, lox meats, puddings, one full stock of each. Let's improvise adapt. If the carts are locked inside the houses, they can't destroy them, so... You know. I might do some. I do have enough resources to do them. I just like to max out on health food. Sake, there was a locksmith still behind there. Asshole game, man. Get down there. I 
I think I've got enough fish for that. You have to ask. Ask away, my guy. Yeah, I know. It just becomes a little bit too crazy if you, when you get too many of them, it just goes completely too crazy. Especially if you're cooking, you know, stuff that like this that cooks really quickly. He just gets a little bit too nuts. Me, this is going through flower. Jesus. All that time making flower, dude, and I'm literally burning it non stop now. Right, might as well do it all. Uh, oh, hold on. I can do another one. Take a full stack of fish wraps as well, then. Time to go and load the boat. Potions, fire potion, food. Anything in there? No, it's empty. Before I go anywhere, because I saw the boat take storm damage earlier. And 
what was I going to do? Chorus. Right, and I'm gonna need four cores. We also need some Great War Fives, which are on that chest, and I believe we need 20 of those, 10 per portal. And we need fine wood forty. Pum 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 pum. Fourteen. Twenty six. What do you mean I've done this before? <sighs> oh, hold on, there's something missing. I forgot the most crucial thing. Is it on that one? Hold on. I got an extra hammer there I don't need. The hoe I might need, the pickaxe I might need. Uh, black metal axe that will definitely most likely come in handy. I did not want to do that. And... I'll trade those over. I'll take the obsidian sword instead of the silver sword. Also... And ta -ta 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 -ta. There. repair. Yep. Oh, silver camp. Oops, wrong portal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was the, uh, I went on that portal and I needed that one. Oops. <laughs> Shit happens. Also forgot something. Frost arrows. take 18 let's take a hundred out repaired repair we are systems go
For real? Fucking waves. Fucking close, boy. Ow, I don't mind the rough seas, dude. You and I both know one thing. When you hit rough seas... What the fuck is damaging the boat, dude? There's nothing there. There's literally nothing there. When you get rough seas, you get a lot of speed out of those. I think my worst nightmare is going to be navigating that straight there. On the longbow, it's a bit of a bitch. Like there's nothing there, the boat's just taking damage out of nowhere. What the hell? also want to check if my other boat is in there so I'm gonna go first here I might not grab it now I might grab it another time but it'll be f nice to know whether that boat is still standing Looks like the boat's gone. Should be on the next bay just behind this rock. Oh, looks like I just hit up. No, it's still there. I still got a carve there. There he is. Right now, this is going to be a bitch. Whoa. Yeah. Dude, it does feel a bit like it. It's really fucking weird.
further to the right. I need to. I need to hit this just on the right sweet spot. I mean, it is possible, Joe. You got reefs and things like that. So it is possible. Handbrake turn. Full sail. Oh. No. No. No waves. Do not be a-holes. Fuck me sideways. I know, right? I kind of mastered the handbrake turn with this boat. Fucking fog. Black Forest. Okay. Well, if it's to the left, it must be to the left. I'm too far away to um, target, so there must be a Black Forest to the left there. There it is. There we go. Ideally, I want to pull it into the meadows. No, you bitch. I gave it too much speed. Bollocks. She's still coming? I gave the boat way too much speed, dude. Gonna try and find it again. Because there comes the thing, serpents also s always spawn on the same spot, by the way.
Oh, she's done for. Yeah, you can keep fighting my bow. You're coming out, bitch. Oh, fuck off. No fucking way. Fuck off, Nack. Oh! Look at that reward. That was worth the hassle. Fucking waves. My son, Kasov. I always destroy the uh, benches, dude. Server stability. Nothing worse than having a load of stuff just dumped on the server. Oh, the wave picking me up. Dude, the way they done the waves in this game is annoying, but amazing at the same time.
Oh, so do I, dude. never found fish in there I just found leeches only ever found leeches there Oh, dude, now we're holding us. Oh, there's a little uh, tower there. Well, on the other side of that mountain, dude, it's wolf camp. Oh, shit. And we're entering unknown. Oh, that looks like planes there. Nope, that's meadows. Whoa, fuck me. Jesus. Yeah, that's Meadows. That's Meadows as well. I see a couple of birch in there. Now it's a good time for a sea serpent to hit me. Dude, I remember the first time I saw a sea serpent. It was on the carve, I was just literally shitting myself. I run for my life.
Oh, we're gonna be making even more time now. Shit. I just turned the turbo on. What I don't see is any land. Fuck me. Is and it's not because if a serpent comes out, I'm not gonna. I don't know where to drag it to. Actually, I think there's some trees there to the far right. Oh no, that's not. That's a fucking floating tree thing. I don't mind sea storms, dude. I used to fucking hate them. Now I actually like them because you just go so fucking fast. Even with side winds. Oh, there he is. Four is traveling through. I don't think that's Odin, I think that will be Thor. Because the lightning is following him. No, I haven't yet. But as far as it stands... Okay, there's one. Oh shit, there's one. Oh shit, there's fucking one. Fuck me. <laughs> okay, there's a serpent. There's a serpent. Good timing, serpent. Come on, where are you? Serpents are pooned. Shit, that's a dark forest there?
Sí. Voy a matarlas todas y te da una comida muy buena. Oh, damn, that's another good hole. <laughs> Now I just need to figure out where I dropped my bow. There. Seriously? Will you guys just fuck off? Right. I don't need that, I don't need that. See Joe? He just takes perfect timing for that serpent to come out, doesn't it? <laughs> See, I mean, tu fazes una, una sopa que se llama sopa de serpiente que te da un monte de, de energía y de um, vida. Fazes ese, ese de aquí, M. ¿Dónde está? Aquí. Esto te da 80 de energía y 80 de vida para... Era una de las comidas mejores del juego para lutar es los bosses. Oh shit. Planes. Watch out for the fucking mosquitoes. going to the ocean that's a dark forest still better than uh... there we go but yeah I've got near my um, main base Joe there's like three serpent spawns um, there's one around there one around there and one around there. Oh! Uh oh. Shitting.
Can I still do another one? Please do not drown. <laughs> Thirty two, good run. <laughs> I thought I might need to uh, file in a request with the BRS, dude. Have you heard of the BRS, Joe? Body Recovery Service is a group of Valheim players that will join your server and um, the amazing. goal is to help you recover your gear. That's all the BRS's. The fuel rod saved my. Oh, dude, you kidding me? Come on. Oh, fuck off. Few rats saved my bacon a fair few times in Elite Dangerous, Joe. The most hilarious one was the first time they came out, dude. Oh, we've got tons, dude. We got more chitin than we actually need. I'm only farming this out of greed. What the fuck's my boat? <laughs> Leaving it little dangerous, boy. First time I called the fuel rats, I was on my uh, combat cutter. <laughs> it's not like it's all, uh, you know, calculated. <laughs> And literally, in a world of a lie, dude, I had five anacondas porting in on me. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's when I realized that cutters were OP as fuck. 
One of them fueled me up, the, all the other ones were clearly locking target on me. <laughs> Few rats are amazing, dude. I can tell you one thing, dude. It would have made them sweat a little bit to break my shields. And I mean sweat. If I was to deploy my shields, it would have they would have uh, sweated a little bit there. I wouldn't have been able to do much, but... They wouldn't have taken them down easily. You know the external modules, Joe? On my cutter, every single one of my external modules, dude, is literally shield boosters. <laughs> that thing's engineered to fuck. I cannot fire my pulse lasers for more than six seconds without getting an overheat sign. <laughs> but then, to be honest, my wall weapons gets depleted <laughs> within that time anyway. <laughs> I went into. Um, I went literally went into a um, dangerous zone with the new guy and I was just telling him just hit them once let me deal with, with the rest and he was like Jesus dude just how much punishment can your ship take and I told him you know just scan me this looks a little bit straight he scanned me and all I heard was him going, what the fuck? <laughs> the most hilarious moment when was he comes in hot and literally just slaps himself into my ship. Oh, you motherfucker. Where is he? Where is he? Because they don't just give up unless I run him over. I must have run him over. That's planes as well? Fuck me. Oh, dude, he was just literally, he just swats his ship into my freaking, um, into my ship. And I was just like, what the fuck just crashed into me? My shields didn't even punch. <laughs> and he was just a fireball. <laughs> I was just like, uh, oops. <laughs> If I get a serpent now, dude, I'm just gonna run it. I'll hit it a few times and make it run. I will not pull a serpent into the planes. Fuck that. Fuck a duck, fuck a duck, fuck a duck. Oh, 
Not today! Oh my god! Um. No, 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 no! Coast, what coast? I didn't see any coast. I don't know what you're talking about. Swamp ahead. Ah, uh, just a couple of trees for the looks of it. Oh no. Oh shit, there's way more than just a couple of trees. Can I go that way? Looks like there's a canal here. This is something I'm possibly going to regret. Badly. That's a big plains biome there. Shit, that's a big fucking camp as well. But damn. If I get a serpent now, dude, I've got nowhere to pull it. One side I got swamps. Looks like there's some forest there that's not swampy area. The other side I got planes. There's more planes coming up. Yep, that's planes biome as well. This way looks like it. Well, we should be nearly in the Ashlands, shouldn't we? Looks like I hit the dead end. Some quick thinking there, boy. Yeah, that's a dead end. Oh, 
Ah, oh, great. Perfect timing for Mother to turn around and go, Oh yeah, your buff is just ended. My boat could do it some repairing. Well, I'm hoping to set up camp and then go and get myself a coffee. What? That's what I'm hoping for. Dark Forest Um this one actually has a lake set up the first base is actually a fucking lake let me show you look all sealed up and there's only two when two entries that's it and we actually set up our first base about there It's the only one I've seen with that so far. <coughs> it's also a bitch, which is why we relocated the base. <coughs> There's also a sea serpent that spawns in the middle of it. <coughs> I know that much. I do wonder what's gonna happen to the mistlands. Because so far there's no NPCs, there's nothing in it. But there's a lot of cobwebs. So I do wonder what is actually going to happen to on them. There's a mountain in the background. Here, silver.
I don't think spiders, dude. I mean, this is the other thing. Or are they going to be adding new bosses as well? All I know is that it's always night in the Mistlands. What, they're adding another four bosses? Ooh, spicy. I mean, we've got one for the swamp. Uh, we've got one for the plains. We obviously got Ectrir, which is the boss for the meadows. Um, <clears throat> we've got Mother, which is for the mountain biome. So I'm guessing Ashlands and. Fuck's sake, another Black Forest. I'm guessing Ashlands and the Frozen Lands will get the boss as well. Well, so far, they don't yet, I don't think. Plains, meadows, black forest, mountain, ashlands, there's what, six or seven? There's a, there's a big mountain biome there to the right. Look at that bad boy. True, but how is that going to, you know, change your map? Oh, we got land ahead of us. And how is that going to affect the seeds? Possibly. You know, if you really want a challenge with mother, you can actually spawn more than one mother at the same time, right? All you need is six eggs. <laughs> I know somebody that's done that. Uh, that doesn't look like where I want to go. Does it? I don't fucking know. Now that looks like Mistlands.
my main kind of question I suppose is you know how how is it that adding new biomes into the game is going to affect the current map and grind that players put up so are we gonna spend ages building bases and then literally we're just gonna have to reset the entire map to go into the new biomes Fuck me, surely I should be there by now, man. That's my golden question. See that island there? I'm tempted to set up base in that island. The fuck? I'm tempted to set up base on the island behind. Motherfuckers, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna pull my boat back away from this. What is this? Ooh, glowing metal. Oh, flame ore. Ooh, what can I do with this? Told you, frost arrows for the wind, dude. Oh, 
Not sure what the fuck he was firing at. And should I be concerned? What does it despawn or something? Or does it burn the chest? No! I do not want that! Motherfucker! Get fucking wrecked! Oh yeah, dude, definitely. See that little island there? That's exactly where I'm gonna be um, setting up camp. And I'm gonna cheese this out. Oh, for fuck's sake. Seriously? Right, change my mind. There was some mist lands just there. That's where I'm going to. Yeah, I see that. I see them. I'm gonna set up in the mist lands. Oh, I'm not gonna bother with that. I'm setting up on the Mistlands. Mistlands, there's no mobs. Whatever I set up in there is safe. Oh, it's only a temporary base, dude. I'll probably end up putting a base down here. But at the moment it's got no mobs and for the time being is possibly one of the safest uh, forward operating bases I can set up.
All I know is I need a bio. My boat kind of needs repairs. Fuck. These guys are way too close for comfort. thought so. Should have brought iron. Actually, no. I don't want a gate on that side. I want a gate. I want the gate to uh, give me a quick exit. Should have brought iron and deploy a stone bench. the servant cores which I already got a metric turn off miscellaneous portal hey there gotcha See? Basic cam set out done. That's how you do it. I'm gonna be right back, dude. I need a bio and I'm gonna get myself a coffee.
I am back, ladies and gents. Right, so. First things first. Now that we set up camp, we can take some of the surplus supplies back to base. These are one that can go back. Um, same with the harpoon. Hmm. Okay, okay. You wanna play games like that? No, 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 no. Come back here. Not my serpent, mate. Whew, that was close. Just gonna pinch that chest for now. All of my campaign stuff will be deployed there. We'll put the harpoon as well. Um, we'll grab another stack of frost arrows. And while we're here, I suppose we might as well repair shit. Now let's fucking go. Uh, that portal. Oh, hell yeah! I mean, those sea serpents gave me quite a lot of food, so I can live with those numbers. Um, <laughs> Fuck off. Oh shit, uh, I might want to run back to the boat and grab some food. Uh, oh boy. Wet? Not exactly something Undead wanted to do. Oh my god, how did that go over his fucking head? There we go. That's a dead skull there. Oh man. What the fuck is wrong with my aim with the bow now, dude? Or are these things just that fucking tiny you can't hit them properly? Oh, he got tagged, I think. Could that be a fucking trophy? <laughs> Through. Fuck off. Oh, he's supercharged. Come on, stop moving. Stop running for five seconds. 
No. Fuck me. Jesus, these guys just constantly spawn. You just got fucked up, boy. And so did you. How the fuck do you survive an arrow to the face, you motherfucker? I'll tell you what, we're definitely getting a lot of coal. Okay, so arrows follow through trajectory, so you've got to fire the arrow ahead of your enemy. That's interesting mechanic. So not only you need to compensate, you know... Sorry guys, I got something stuck to the base of my mouse. There we go. So not only you need to account distance, you've got to take into account where the target's going to be. Yeah, I'm not sure I want to start a fight there. Oh, fuck it. That one's just got fucked up. That one just got fucked up. That one landed next to him. Now he's running around like another chicken. There's one behind me? Again? No, 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 you need to go um, fire where the target's going to be as well, dude. I've tried that. I was, I kept missing arrows when I was shooting exactly where they were. And I fired one ahead of his direction of movement. And I ended up hitting a bullseye. Fuck, missed that. He's just got fucked up. He's just got fucked up as well. Ah, you don't need a water bucket, boy. Got frost arrows. I mean, the only good thing coming out of this at the moment is serving cores. Non stop and fucking call. What the fuck? Fuck you. Eight cores already in the metric ton of coal, Jesus. Fuck's sake. Oh, they are getting ripped. That 
that's a good question. I might need to go and get one. Dude, I'm gonna need to move forward because I'm just literally, no matter where I turn, I just constantly ripping them. Look, there's another one there. I mean, don't get me wrong, coal is good. Looks like it. I mean, how many more, uh, how many more cores do I want? Ah, oh, shit, there's a car there. Uh, 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 uh. We'll soon find out if the wishbone does anything. But if it does, what the fuck are you gonna find in there hiding? That's what I wonder. I mean, forget gilms, you don't need gilms, just go in there, shoot a lot of those motherfuckers and you fill up on coal. There's another one on top of the hill already. It's already up there. In this little bit, dude, I burned through 40 arrows. What the hell? goes one they're actually pretty easy to kill oh I just got a trophy Well, I want to try and find some more of that metal, dude. I know there's some on that island where I was going to settle up base. I did see some in there.
There. And I already seen uh, some there as well. Just picking them up. Fuck, I missed that last arrow. And that one. That guy there is gonna cause me problems. Come on. Come on. You see that one? I fired the. I let the arrow loose just ahead of him. Motherfucker turned again. Oh, for real, dude. Well, fuck you then. Fuck, I left the potions in the thing. Yeah, I got one trophy head already, dude. I got that out of um, an attack on my base. I thought I could hear something running. Oh my fucking days. Fuck it. Yep. So the traveling time of the arrows also influences everything. No stamina. Fuck you. One down. No. No, about to unnoose. Unnoose uh, an arrow. I'm not sure it's gonna hit target. Oh, my running is at 49. Jesus.
<laughs> oh, dude, I do a lot of naked runs. So if I die, I just tend to uh, do a full naked run back. See, again, just slightly ahead of where he was. Yeah, I need to put the magging lower down. Doesn't look like the wishbone is picking up anything, dude. Pull down here, dude. This shed solo to farm? Is a bitch. You just pick up so fucking much weight. Oh shit. Missed that arrow. I'll trade blows with you any day, boy. You guys ain't really hurting me that much at the moment. Come on. Come on. There. Oh no, still missed. Oh, not a trophy. I'll have that. Oh, man, why am I doing? Other than wasting arrows. Ooh, dumb. It's got to have been a headshot. Dude, you can't aim for shit. Psst. Yeah, you literally coming back, killing everything you just killed. By the way. I didn't even go that far and already got 400 kilos of weight on me. And again, the same dose. Yeah, see? They're in there. I'm not even gonna bother running to the forge. But I will most likely need to make some uh, frost arrows soon. Which means I might need to go and farm drakes. Yeah, that's when my base got attacked um, by them the other day. 
I should have um, gone and changed my power to Fenrir, uh, to Ectrir as well. Like I said, I'll trade blows with you any day, boy. You guys stick on me for five seconds and that's it. Oh, I just shoot them sh sh Drakes, I just shoot them sh stupid out of the sky, dude. You'd be shocked how fast I shoot the Drake down. Oh my god, there was not enough elevation on that shot. Again? Not enough elevation on that shot is just... That was just stupid. Too, f too much lead. He wasn't walking fast enough. At his feet? Cheers, dude. I needed to warm up. I see more metal down there. Looks like a little swim across the lake. We all know they can't attack me across water. Or can they? Can they reach me here? Unless the water does heat damage, which I'm hoping it doesn't. Fuck you, mofos. Oh hell yeah, boy!
Can I just uh, mine this in peace, please? Thank you. Too much lead. What am I doing? Motherfuck. Right at his feet again. Man. What is wrong with me and the fucking boat today? Fuck you. Man, what is wrong with me in this boat today? Again? For real game? You're just gonna keep fucking me over like this? They're actually extremely weak, dude. It doesn't take a lot to kill them. The main problem is to get the hit in. That was a shot. So there was ever a redemption shot, and they just done it. Yeah, dude, uh, you're in the water. I don't think you're gonna fire up for too long. 
I just picked up another trophy. <laughs> Dick. Right, they can't really hit me from behind. I haven't tried it. I know you can parry um, arrows from the archers. Goodbye, Stone. It's a long cross here. I think I'm on about 30 metal now, dude. If not more. Perfect hit. On the core. Are you just gonna sit there? Oh, you bastard. Yeah, that's a shit show for me to cross. Can we do it? Can we do it? Oh, oh yeah! I'm just wasting arrows now. Need to get a bit closer. Get by the gauge. Oh my fucking days, dude.
I think you guys are kind of getting fucked over there. Or weapons. You'll be one of the two. Fuck you, motherfucker. I said fuck you. I didn't say come and fucking fire, throw fireballs at me, you prick. A hole. Dude. There's a few nice neat little islands off the coast here. Where you could possibly kind of set up um, a camp. Man, I fucking hate when you're on fire. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, you bastard. Oh, look, bird. Frozen bird. Jesus, these motherfuckers are bloody relentless, dude. Bows at thirty two. Swig of my coffee. Get rid of the stuff I got loads of. Oh, this is a black forest biome? Oh, that's interesting. What the fuck? What the fuck is that motherfucker doing all the way down there? No, no, no! Get me up! I need to get the fuck out of here. I'm in a really shit spot to fight them. There we go. Right, 
plan B. Holy shit, two trophies? Yeah, I can live with that. Jesus. My boat's a my bow's a little bit worn out. Is that my boat down there? Yeah, there's my boat. Twenty-three. I am running low on arrows. I'm very tempted to make my way back. To be honest. <sighs> All through this being said, that and the fact I want to smelt that thing and figure out what I can do with it. You want to see what I can do with that as well, don't you? <laughs> Four trophy heads, Jesus. That's seven. Not on this one. There they are. Uh, workbench. Frost arrows. Freeze gun. No, that's the wrong ones. Fuck. Um. I know I have freeze glands, guys. Just bear with me. They're gonna be in here somewhere. In one of these. Empty. No, there's um. Stingers there. We'll put them with needle arrows for now. That's poisonous, that's fire. No. Wood arrows, I'm sure they'll just tickle them. They might be in the kitchen area. That's more dragon tears. There we go. See? I told you we had some freeze glands. Frost arrows. I also need wood and obsidian. I got plenty of both in the uh, main house. Obsidian and wood. See, we always worth farming. Oh, I need feathers and there. Uh,
You can tell I killed a few drakes, can't you? Just a couple. <laughs> oh, dude, I just killed him stupid. It's absolutely ridiculous how easy I killed him now. He literally is two fire arrows, that's it. And the second one doesn't even need to be fully cocked. Obsidian. Oof. Well, looks like I'm gonna need to go and farm more obsidian in the mountains. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, dude. the wood again I'm nearly out of obsidian as well Frost arrows are by far my favorite arrow to use. You probably noticed that. I think the combination of frost attacks with the um, feathers, wood. Combination of frost attacks with the poison is just evil. It absolutely does destroys them making sure that's the right chest one two three four five, six we'll leave that in there with them um, Anything I hit with frost and poison combined, it just seems to fuck them up good and proper. So, I'm gonna go fish wrap this time, blood pudding and sea serpent. Just stay still for a split second, will you? I only want to, you know, give you a little cooldown gift. He's fucked. I 
still didn't go and get Fenrith. Ah, uh, Fenrith? What the fuck? Ictrir. On another pile. I think once I farm this pile, I might try and find the second one, and then I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna make my way back to camp. Would have been too good to be true, wouldn't it? That's just a coal pile. I might just charge in, there's only one left. Where the fuck is he going? There. No, Fenrith is the, um, Fenrith is the, uh, werewolf <clears throat> in this game. He comes out to play at night. Don't say no to serving course for Fuck you boy. Oh shit, he had to drop another one, didn't he? Haven't you met Fenrith yet in the game? I believe so. I think certain items do eventually despawn, not all of it. I 
I mean, I'm grabbing a metric ton of free coal here, dude. I'm not gonna go grumble on that one. Oh my days, landed at his feet again. Ah, oh, that is feet again, fuck it. We'll go this way. Hoping for some more metal. I think they've all burned down, dude. I mean, everything in here is just ash. Okay, I see it. That's the way you want to do it. Okay. No matter where you turn, you just complete dash. I should build something for someone to discover. <laughs> Oh, 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 pile. That's the final pile uh, before I head back. Oh. Do not move. I said do not fucking move. Oh my fucking god. Fuck you. Now we're gonna discover if we're gonna unlock, what are we going to unlock when I smelt this. My best guess is this is gonna need the blast furnace. Stay there. Dude, that was so close. That's two down. Let's make it the third one. Oh shit. We got one there. Yeah, dude, just run straight towards me. You know.
You missed, I didn't. First one was a warning shot. Well, if that's the case, then he's going to stay stashed in a, uh, in a crate, which I will be hiding. Which only undead will know its location. And um, when the later patch is available, we'll have some there. Oh, if I've got to choose between floor metal or or stone, dude, uh, floor metal wins hands down, or even coal. Oh, why? A fucking fat finger, the F key. Now I've got to run all the way back to the boat. And I'm probably going to be trading blows with most of these motherfuckers. Arrow straight to the face. Oh shit. Motherfucker. I think they just got a bit fucked up. I don't think they like my hammer too much.
Just, just a gut feeling. What you reckon, Joe? Oh, maybe, dude. I mean, this thing's weight 12 kilos a piece. I said I don't think they like my hammer too much. Just, uh, just a gut feeling. That's a big fucking skull to be there. Fucking kidding me? I literally ran out of energy just as I boarded the fucking boat. Well, there goes a bunch of coal. Oh, they don't frost effect. 58 frost damage, 35 blunt with 20 spirit on top of that for good measure they definitely do not like this hammer I'm gonna try and cut a straighter line this time so I'm gonna try and go through that side it's the uh, the frostner It, I found out it fucks a lot of things up, dude. You need silver, ancient bark, and a few more things. Better than the iron. Uh, the iron hammer is a two-handed. This one's a single-handed. So you can actually, you know, use your shield, and you still got your hammer. And this thing fucks things up. Oh shit! Guess what I left behind. I left the harpoon at base. 
should have put it back in the boat and I didn't. And my bow is nearly fucked up. Shit. That's not gonna last me that fucking long. That was a fuck up. Well, you got the stack breaker. You got the iron hammer, which is similar to the stack breaker. And then you got the frostner. That is pretty much pants. There's no two ways about that. On the plus side, my boat's in good shape, so... As long as I can get to a shoreline, I can fight the serpent on the shore. I'm good with that. be an interesting journey that's a fact So far, a shortcut seems to be working. Another nine minutes and I can activate the... Um, water. <laughs> okay, now we got some wind. Now every time I go to the front like this, I normally find myself heading towards land, not this time. Okay. There's land ahead. I saw the trees. Maybe not. No, we're in open waters. Proper open waters. Oh, maybe not. I see planes. But where? Yeah, nah. The Frostner dude is an amazing weapon. I definitely recommend grinding for it. Let's just say mobs know when you hit them. This this one just 
pretty much does um what's the knockback on this? 120 knockback and the frost staggers them, gives them that little split, you know, couple of seconds where they just slow right down and you just keep hitting them. Two hundred knockback? Damn. Yeah, but that's a two-handed, and what I found, especially with the stag breaker, he uses a load of stamina, and he's just slow on the um, second hits. So if you don't fuck them up properly on the first one, he takes a little couple of tries to load it up. Pom 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 Oh shit What the fuck E shitteroo 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 this is bad mojo. Big planes biome. Maybe I should have gone around the other side of it. That's more planes. Oh boy. I don't like this shit. Yeah, I tend to walk around a bit. I just move. Move around mobs, then especially those that fire stuff at you, they tend to fire at where you are. So as soon as they fire, if you walk either to left or right, they miss the target. Problem is, especially when you go, you know, to where I just was, the Ashlands. The main problem you're gonna find there is when you get multiple ones of them. Oh, come on, come on. You know you can give me a little bit more. There we go. Okay. We're through. This was actually quite fast. A510. Yeah, pretty much. As long as you keep your character moving, dude, you are gonna be laughing. Oh boy. Uh, 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 uh. I wanna ride that wave. Come on, give me a wave, give me a wave, give me a wave. Ow, you bastard. We can get it through. Just need a wave. 
Give me a good wave. There we go. We're through. I need wind. If I get a good wind, I can cut ride the waves through this. Yeah, boy. Oh, trust me, we are gonna go for it. Oh hell yeah, I now just need a storm to stack up on it. Big ol' ocean around here. I got a feeling I'm gonna get a visit from Mama Serpent as well. it closer to the left well I'm already halfway back so coming across that side was definitely much faster uh, never had it um, happen to me dude of course we're gonna get a serpent It wouldn't be funny otherwise, would it? There she comes. Fuck off. Damage my boat.
Exactly, you can't even dive or anything, so... Well, mother is about to wear off. I'm not that far away now, so we're good. We can, uh... Oh, there goes the wind. Oh, fuck off. For real? Oh, man. Oh, it's not actually too bad. Did slow me right down. Oh, when it's changing. Ah, that's a fair chunk of damage there. I just want to make it back to base and start and smelt at least one of them before I call it a night. It's 1am for me again. We're near with her. <laughs> Pretty much. Okie dokes. We're on the final stretch now. Shadow, just lie down. Man, I actually want a proper storm. I know I'm getting his rain. Yeah. Still not the greatest, mine.
Oh, wind is moving to the rear. These are gonna line up with the boat. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Yeah, but on the way there, dude, I had no idea where I was going. And on top of that, look the long way I went, and look the way I came up. <laughs> so it makes a difference. Still a long fucking hole, mine. the arm stretch now Looks like there's a Kraken to the far right. Not even gonna bother. Seven more minutes. Oh, definitely still worth it.
Right, we're through the first straight. That's it. You're on out. Home stretch. You had to say it, I was lucky with the wind, didn't you? point another three minutes and I can activate uh, mother gonna twat it. It's gonna hit. something yay Almost going, the rear end tagged the rock. It was almost there. <laughs> yeah, I've done that straight a few times, so I kinda know where I need to. Uh, go for it. Sorry, I was just a uh, momentary brain freeze here. Activate mother soon.
go. Don't get me home a bit faster. Home straight. This is one I could do with a storm. Oh, I see the few. I see the uh, badly planned lighthouse. real did he just throw something at the skeleton Fucking looked like it. Oh, for me, I'm good, dude. I'm at base. Right. Don't have any processable items. Uh oh. Uh oh. I was right. It's in the blast furnace. You can smell it.
New material, flame metal. But that's it. It just says new material, flame metal. Okay. Well, it doesn't look like there's anything yet. I know, right? That was a bit of a disappointment. I'll put it in there for now. At least we'll go a new material. much stuff is in there still too once it's final to uh, smelt that's me done I'll finish melting the rest tomorrow in the meantime it's gonna be bedtime for me my son as usual He'll be up early. I'm sure there's going to be something coming into the game. I don't think they would have added it into the game if there wasn't uh, something coming. That's just my gut feeling. Right, that is it. Guys, appreciate you hanging out. In the meantime, Undead is an old bastard and he needs to go and get himself some sleep. So, thank you very much. Appreciate the uh, support and the company. Joe, my guy, I'll catch you again tomorrow. In the meantime, I need to go and get some snooze. So for now, ladies and gents, Undead is over and out.